What's up y'all, Scarberry here with Laryngitis, unfortunately, but uh, this I, I, I want to play this game so bad, so I'm going to push through it and play this game. It's called Camp Sunshine. It's, it's made by Fossil Games, who I was fortunate enough to win their Twitter contest, and I won a Camp Sunshine poster. Well, when I give, gave them my information, they gave me a game key. Holy crap! So, I gotta play it. I'm so excited this came out, I think, a half hour ago for me. Um, but I got T here, and I added a face cam, because in case I totally peek and squeak out of range, if I get startled, you'll be able to see my reaction on the camera. One of those corners. Um, but yeah, uh, I don't know much about this game. It's obviously a throwback to this like 80s slasher flicks that were amazing. That's why it's pixelated, like the old style games from the time period, and it's amazingly beautiful. And uh, as far as I can tell, it's the camp mascot, maybe? And uh, it's if Jason Voorhees and Freddy Fazbear decided to get together and procreate, this would be their love child. But that's all I know. Um, I'll start a new game. <laughs> oh, what kind of camper are you? Well, I don't want to just do a walk in the park because that's probably not very exciting. But I don't want to get totally bogged down in just getting run over by a bear. So let's do mid-grade because I want to make sure I can actually get through this game with you guys. So. <clears throat> so, kiddo, are you looking forward to summer camp? We're getting close. Mom is a heavy smoker. Mm, yeah, I guess so. So is baby boy. Hey, we'll have less of that attitude, young man. This is as hard for us as it is for you. Sorry, Mom. I just don't see why I have to leave all my friends back home. I know it's been tough recently, but I promise you that I'll have everything settled when you get home. It wasn't an easy choice for your father and I to separate. I'm sorry. Really, I am. Oh, God. I know, Mom. I know you're doing the best for us. This is a really heavy start. Oh, look! We're almost there! <laughs> Let's get you checked in. Hi there, and welcome to Camp Sunshine. Now that you're here, we'd like to go over our rules. We have an open door policy during the day around camp. However, we do lock the doors at night for our camper's welfare. And you're also allowed to smoke six packs a day, but that's it. You gotta cap it at six. We'll do everything we can to make you feel like a ray of sunshine. We want you to be happy here. Just smile, smile, smile. Sure thing, I'm a super happy camper. Hey, come on, Jez. Show some respect. Jez. So, wait, no, you're a man. Because I was going to say, maybe your name is Jezebel, but I don't know what that's short for. Oh, don't worry, it's okay. Lots of campers are full of nerves when they first arrive here. It might be that super creepy mascot. I don't know, but it may be. Anyway, I think it's about time we showed you to your cabin. Capitalize. Right this way. And here we have your bunk. I'll leave you in the capable hands of Jack here, who can show you around your space. Jack looks an awful lot like Markiplier. <laughs> it is Markiplier. <laughs> hey man, good to meet you. I'm Jack. The love child of Jack Septiguy and Markiplier. I'll be your roommate for your stay at Camp Sunshine. Let's get your thanks put away, and you can say goodbye to your mom for forever. Okay, baby, I'll see you next week. Promise me you'll try to have fun, okay? I love you, baby. Call me every day. Kisses. Ugh, okay, mom. Bye. Little jerk. Your stuff goes in this set of drawers here. Anywho, it's getting late, so we should hit the hay. Good night, bud. See you in the morning for the Camp Sunshine Welcome Breakfast. Oh, great. We're already starting with the nicknames. I'm Bud. There's a bit of paper in here. Let's take a look. Oh, okay, co controls. Um, I'm using the, uh, the keyboard and mouse. Or 
not mouse, because I can't use a mouse. I'm using the keyboard, so inventory is escape. It's dark in here, hopefully I don't miss buttons. Escape, shift to run, move, WASD, oh, that's easy. Flashlight, E, map, M, interact space. Okay, I can, I can remember that. Oh, that makes absolutely no sense. Weird. Anyway, that's all my stuff went away. <laughs> Good night, Jack. See you in the morning. Good night, buddy. Is he gonna live or is he gonna die? I don't know. Let's watch. <laughs> Holy shit, what the hell was that? Jack, are you there, buddy? <laughs> no. Oh, great. We're off to an awesome start. There's blood everywhere. My suitcase, let's get changed out of these jammy jams. I don't want to. Keep on your jammy jams. Damn it. Well. There you go. Don't change out of your jammy jams. There's blood everywhere. Fuck. Am I just wandering through it? That's morbid. Can't interact with this bed. Or the lamp. Or that lamp. Oh my god. Okay, can I get anything? I found my flashlight. Alright, hey, that's good. Wait, oh, it has a battery life. Which was E. Wait, right? Yeah, E. Cupboard won't open. There's probably a key. Also, that's it. Suited and booted. I need to go and find a counselor. Come here, kid. Oh my god, okay. Oh fuck, what the hell is that thing? I better hide. Where do I hide? Oh my god. Okay. Um, shit to run. Oh wait, that's a oh, it's automatic. <laughs> I'm hiding in a ch in a bush. Obviously, he didn't see me. Whatever that it is, it seems attracted to my flashlight. I'd better be careful. Okay. Now, where the hell do I find a counselor? Yeah, they didn't mention that, did they? Oh, okay. I'm still not controlling it. Hmm. I'm sure the counselor hut was around here somewhere. Let me just check the map. <laughs> I better not look at this for too long, though. That weird bear creep will sneak up on me. Uh, that's a big hint. Where the hell am I? Alright, well, um, 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 Counselor Hangout's up, right? Okay. Hopefully it should be this way. Oh, am I heading north then? Anyone there? Oh, fantastic. We found Jack! We found Jack! Part of him. There he is. The top part. That's half a body. Okay, it's the top half. Good. I need to find some help. Hello? Anyone here? Probably not. <laughs> uh, of course. There's the lower half. We found it. Um, how do I interact? It's not letting me. Let's just stomp on it. Do -do -do. There are more. It says, there are more. And there are blood trails leading to the right. There's a torn page on this desk. Let's see what it says. There's something written at the top. It says, find them all. They will stop him. Cremate the memories. So maybe, let's take a read. So, okay. Oh, they're journal entries. 20th of June, 1964. What a happy day. Myself and my wife, Wendy, have just landed our dream summer job as camp counselors at Big Bear Summer Camp. We are both so excited. And even though we've been driving for hours, we can't wait to see our new home. What's even more exciting is that Wendy has been having little flutters all day long, so it can't be long now. You're driving for hours to a camp out in the middle of nowhere, and it sounds like she's like nine months pregnant. What the hell is wrong with you? Go home, go to any job near a hospital, you dumbasses. Okay. Yep, Toad's pregnant. Toad's gonna get axe murdered or knife murdered. I don't think it was an axe, it was a knife. 
I can't believe we're here, Wendy. We've finally made it to Big Bear Lake. I know, Jacob. It's fantastic. Man, she should also she should also lay off the smokes while she's pregnant. It's terrible. This place is absolutely beautiful, and I know that we'll be so happy here. Let's get inside, though. It's getting dark. And it's a bear. Wow, this place is enormous. I can't wait to get started on making it ours. Look, the management even left us a sunshine bear teddy, too, for our little one. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. That sunshine bear teddy might be important. Maybe I need to find it. But, but not right now, Jacob. It's late. Let's get some sleep. <laughs> Good night, Mom. I love you. I love you, too. Here's to us in our brand new home. Nothing will possibly go wrong. Wait, can you hear that? It sounds like it's coming from the island? Weird. <laughs> oh God, some shadows are dancing around a fire. <laughs> Jacob, wake up, my water just broke. Isaac is on the way. He's totally not the devil, he's not. Oh my, okay baby, let's go and have our baby boy. Probably at the nurse's office, because they're stuck at camp. Like idiots. What the hell? That didn't make any sense. I agree. Those people do not seem like fitting parents. But whoever wrote this seems pretty committed. Maybe there's a way to stop this. You don't even know what's going on yet. Maybe there are answers in these diary pages. But for now, I need to get help. Yeah... I don't know how to save. It's a fire escape route. That's helpful. Wow. They go, no! Oh! Okay, that's how you save. <laughs> Alright, let's make Okay, yeah, okay, totally saved. This bed really doesn't look comfortable. I'll need to find a better one to rest in. Blood on the window. Apparently he doesn't care, though. He, he dragged them at a right angle. That's so crazy. Crazy bear. Oh, I, should, oh, I need to turn off my flashlight. Freaking out, man. Uh, so you can hide, you hide in bushes. <laughs> That's good to know. I can't read this side. Wait, can I check the map from a bush? No. <laughs> Where's my M? Wait. Oh, do you need... Wait, where's... Oh, hold on. I want to test that. Can we check the map? There it is. It worked. It worked. Okay, so... I have no idea where I should go now. Probably not the swimming pool. And probably not the island. Um, I don't know. I, I'm trying to figure out where I came from. Maybe. I don't know. I'm still hiding in a bush. It's good to check the map when you're in a bush. Oh. Whoops. Wrong button. I don't know what to do. Oh, I see more blood under the porch. That's good. Where am I now? Oh! Oh, hi! Finally, they've sent someone to help. Uh uh. No, I need your help. Well, hello to you, too. Have you come about the heating? Oh my god, not real. Good. Well, I haven't had any heating since I arrived here, and it's just not good enough. 
My parents have paid for me to have this luxury cabin. And all I've seen so far is dirt and grime. I mean, look, I don't even have a mattress. Unbelievable. First world problems, huh? It's disgusting. Not to mention that awful welcome note left for me in my drawer. Who the hell writes that kind of stuff? Give it to me! There's mention of Isaac, Jacob, and some weird stuff going on here years ago. Sounds like a diary page. Can I have it? <clears throat> not a chance. Not until you've got the heating working again. You bastard. Ugh, leave it to Beaver. Maintenance man came, took one look, and then walked off, so I'm stuck here with no heating. No, no, I know that. Southeast of the camp. Got it. Okay, well, you're a jerk, and I don't like you. Yeah, I'll go right ahead and leave this well alone. <laughs> go ahead and save. Wait, there's a perfectly good bed one room over, and there's nobody occupying the room. God, what a prima donna. And I can't get into his room because he's in the way. What's that? Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. It's nothing. Got your hopes up. How much you want to bet when I come back he'll be dead? Yeah, there's like blood all over the place. Okay. Map. Southeast is down by the fire pit. Okay, I need it. Oh, that's a tree. Okay, the footsteps are creeping me out. I guess good job, because I'm really creeped out. So I'm going to go hide in the bush. <laughs> Alright, where am I? I'm getting there, kind of. That's a long way to walk, though. I guarantee I'm going to get chased once, at least. Wait, what's in here? Nope. Nope. Isaac's here. Holy crap, where? Oh, God. L lovely. Hey, that's not cool. Look, have you seen any diary pages around here? Nice and talkative, huh? Maybe there's a way I can pull her away from the TV. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, I'm gonna save again. Sweet, a little R&R. &R. Maybe if I cut these wires, that girl will stop staring at the TV and talk to me. Yep. She probably just died. Hey, were you just in here? Yep. Yeah, but seemed really interested in the static on the TV. I don't know what came over me. Sorry for being so rude. Oh, that's all right. I don't suppose you've seen a diary page around here. Oh, I have. I left it in the drawers. I'll just move the bed for you. And her eyes got all weird again. Thanks. No problem. I'm happy to help. Now let me just see how to get this TV working again. It's not gonna work again. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Found a diary page. 21st of June, 1964. I'm so sorry. We couldn't do anything to save her. God damn it! That's sad! It's almost like she took one look at your son and... Her heart stopped. Nurse Johnson, that is not something that should be said. We say that in private in the break room. I'm sorry. I've never seen anything like this before. The only condolence we have is that your son is very healthy. You should take some solace in that. We'll leave you for a little while. Again, we're sorry for your loss. What are we going to do? I can't do babies. So, we have to stay here for three days so they can teach me what to do. 
you gotta remember this is 1964. This was before they even allowed men into the delivery room with their wives. So that's actually historically accurate. It's fair. But why do I sense no sadness in your eyes? Why? Because he's a fucking baby. He doesn't know what's going on. He'll be sure sad when he gets hungry and there's no boob to be latched to. My beautiful Wendy, know one thing. You were loved. I will do everything I can to make sure Isaac is looked after. I'll always love you. I'll keep your hospital bracelet close to remind me of you every day. You gave me everything. I'll miss you so much. Your face, your smell, you really were perfect. I love you and always will. Hmm, why is it that Wendy's hospital bracelet really sticks out to me in this page? <laughs> I don't know, maybe because it was highlighted. Oh, God, sad. June 20, June 28th, 1964. In the name of God, the Merciful Father, we commit the body of Wendy Illerman to the peace of the grave. From dust you came, and to dust you shall return. I shall leave you for a moment. Please stop by the church if you would like to talk. My beautiful Wendy, I can't believe you are gone. You were my absolute everything. And now that should be Isaac. Ahem. Oh, he was wearing a red, red rose in his lapel. I stayed and talked with a priest until night fell. He made me realize that with his mother gone, Isaac will need me more than ever. Come on, man! What? What? Is she... Oh, wait. Is she gonna be the bloody bear? This drawer won't open. Great! Okay. Power is cut, so the TV is off. Leave me alone. I'm trying to think why the TV isn't working. Yeah, I would stay. Stay in here, little bobbit. Interact. Have your little nap, I think. Yup. I might have to stop. Okay, my flash... Excuse me, my flashlight's off. But why do I need it? Oh, I don't want to go that way. Oh, wait, okay. You can collect flowers? But Why? Just the white ones. Huh. That's really interesting. I'm gonna have to uh, keep an eye on that. Awesome. Oh, crap. Well, I think that's a... No, that's nothing. I hear you. Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, no! Oh, that was good. Holy crap. Man, I hate doing this. Found a set of batteries. Okay. Oh, my heart's racing now. Good God. That poor thing. Okay, so... I've already loot. I mean, relieved her of her goods. The annoying thing is that I can't get past her to rest. Yeah, I noticed that. Oh, God. Oh my god, sweet lord Jesus. Oh, okay. Wait, I need care. that My throat hurts now. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Whew. Oh my. No flashlight for me. Holy crap. We're just gonna hide for a second. Just in case. Okay. Wrong button again. My bad. What the hell? All right. Um, 
I guess I can't go that way. Right? Wait, let's test that. Wait, I... <laughs> God! I don't wanna! How do I... Sp no, sprint! Why are you not... We're gonna go save. <laughs> Why were you not sprinting? Oh god, okay. Uh, I don't know how much I can take for this session. Hold on. Alright, let's go up. Oh, I'm like, already out of sprint juice. Crap. And I keep thinking I'm hearing footsteps that aren't mine. Oh my god, where am I? Give me a bush! Oh my god. What is this? Nope. Nope. Where have you gone? Oh my god, where's a bush? Oh, great. Well, and there's a dog. Well, let's see if I can save. I have no idea where I'm at. Nope, can't save there. Oh my god, I just need a bush to hide in. Come on. Piece of paper in it that says, All work and no play makes Isaac a dull boy. Weird. Sounds like a terrible novel. Okay. Sunshine time. No! No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Game over. Oh. oh my god, my heart. Okay. Um... God, no, I'm gonna, I wanna find a safe, like, a better... <sighs> well, we're gonna continue. Holy crap, so you gotta really save your sprint juice, huh? Oh my god. What is this? Damn it, locked. Because of course. Can I hide in a bush? <laughs> okay, so we know where a bush is. There's blood under like every window. Where am I? Oh my god. Why don't you come over here and play? <laughs> <laughs> I ran the wrong direction. Oh man. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna end this episode here, but this is a lot of fun. This is, this has gotten me. And uh, whoever you got for the voice actor for uh, Camp Sunshine Bear, Sunshine Teddy, Sunshine Bear Teddy, um, whoever that voice actor is, that oh my god. Okay, but I'm gonna end this one here because um, I'm not sure I can handle much more squealing. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, this is great, and I'm gonna keep playing it because I'm really excited to try to get past it. Honestly, if I keep running into them too badly, I'll change the difficulty level, but I'd really rather not, um, because I, I want to at least see this through if I can. So. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Comments are always welcome in the comment section below. Hit that like button if you like this video, and I hope to see you back for my next one. Thanks, guys. Bye!